Hey, hello everybody, welcome to Nutritious Fitness. I'm your host, Kurt Dirksen, certified personal trainer. Uh, just want to go over um, nutrition, fitness, mental health, all packaged into one today, and I'll tell you how in a second here. Uh, first of all, I just want to explain, uh, I've been almost 20 years as a software engineer. My goal as a software engineer all along was to write perfect code. And what I mean by that is, no bugs. Fix the bug, don't create another. Add a new feature to the software, don't create bugs. Of course, I'm only human, working with complex systems, working with other people and their fingers in that code. So, my goal never achieved, nevertheless remained a goal throughout. Now, in my later in life professional career as a personal trainer and nutrition consultant, I would like perfection. I would like to educate. I would like to make my clients, you the YouTube viewer, quote unquote, bug free. And what I mean by that is you know everything and I am out of a job. Just like if I was able to write perfect code as a software engineer, the software would run perfectly. Nothing more to do other than maybe the occasional adding of a new feature. Here, I'd like to share, educate, and pass on to you knowledge and make for a perfect person in the gym in their own fitness health nutrition and once again i have nothing to do i'm fired great would love it but i need your help i can't pass on everything to you because i can't possibly learn everything myself and that's where today's lesson comes in i need you to read educate i know a scary word maybe some of you are Still in your education years, 18, 19, going on to college. Maybe some of you are out of your education years by 20, 30, 40 years. I don't know. Doesn't mean you can't educate. It's not a scary word. Call it learning. Call it whatever you like. Something that's a little easier to digest than education. It's not formal, but what I'd like to discuss is learning through reading. Something I do all the time. I also spend time watching YouTube videos and online courses and things like that. Uh, I'm just going to share a couple of books that I'm reading right now. First one, Glute Lab, Brett Contreras, PhD. Bright guy, big book, 600 pages. And you're thinking, what, 600 pages all about glutes? That's what I thought it might be too, and I thought, how? Now, it's actually a very good book about working your glutes, but more importantly, it covers everything. Periodization, in other words, how to set up your training plan, whether you're just a casual trainee or you plan on being a world-class power lifter. It covers all that very well, in some ways better than some books that I've read specifically on program design and periodization. Other book I'm reading, How Not to Diet. What was the guy's name again? Dr. Gregor, sorry, didn't remember that one off the top of my head, even though I watch them all the time on YouTube, nutritionfacts.org and Nutrition Facts, the YouTube channel. Great stuff, a uh, little skewed towards vegetarianism. Uh, I'm not a vegetarian. I don't take offense to somebody trying to pass that idea on to me. I think it's a great idea, ethically, health-wise. Uh, but I love my protein, I love my meat. If you do too, don't take offense, but consider reading it. Um, again, these are just two books that I'm reading right now. I'm not getting anything out of advertising them. Loot Lab, How Not to Diet, Brett Contreras, Dr. Gregors. The idea is, I'd like you to pick a book on fitness, pick a book on nutrition, both. Maybe not 1,100 pages worth combined, but by all means, dive into something big like that if you'd like. All right? Remember, fitness is nutritious. Nutrition is fitness. Fitness and nutrition together are health. Join me. Educate yourself. Share with me. Tell me when I'm wrong. I'd love to hear it. Okay? Take care. Stay safe. Come back for the next video.